Hi everyone, my name is Peter Bikalski. Today we have a, a tutorial, so if you have devoted to investment plan building, so if you have some business idea, um, you don't know much about Microsoft Excel, you need to somehow uh, calculate how much financing you need and when uh, and on what you need this financing during the investment stage. Today I will show you how you can build an uh, investment plan uh, using very simple formulas. I'll be showing it uh, to you from scratch. I only have a timeline, nothing else. So it is a absolutely clear Microsoft Excel spreadsheet. So um, maybe this video will be valuable for you. You may give us a like, subscribe, share this video with your friend. You can also order financial models from scratch for your unique business ideas. We can help you with that. So um, what we have to start with? First of all, we start with uh, we, we are creating some kind of library of years that that are inside our um financial horizon so for example we have 10 year horizon then we create the libraries of months these are this is our next step and what we are doing next we are uh, creating the table of inputs so this is some kind of investment plan core where we specify what we invest in when we how much we invest in when we invest in so um, here we place um, investment item so here specify uh, so for example what we purchase uh, on the investment stage so for example here will be here will be the list of uh, what we are going to invest during the investment stage of our business idea so so these are the inputs so we mark them with specific color This is not, by the way, this is the header of uh, this table. Then we specify the next column will be um, price per unit. Then we specify how much units we uh, purchase on the investment stage. Then we calculate total. So for example, the price will be like this. The amount will be like this. We can just make some adjustments. So. So these are the inputs. So we color them with specific, um, with blue, like all our inputs. Then we calculate totals. Then we 
then we specify when we invest this money so here we specify year month of investment so for year we will take use uh, data validation year will be taken from this library from this list uh, format cells home this is the input so we color this with blue Then we specify the month when we invest this amount of money. So um, we use also data validation. Here we will take column B with the list of months. This is our month library. So. This is also the input, so we our inputs. Then we calculate totals. And now we have to place all these data inside the timeline. So we already have the timeline here. And our next uh, step will be writing formula for placing all this data and all these items inside the timeline. So investment plan. So here we will place what we invest in, the list of items. Here we get the totals. And now I will write the formula for um, for these items inside the timeline. So this will be if and function if and if this year if this year fixing freezing uh, the line uh, equals to this year fixing freezing column then and and this month and this month and this month um, equals to this month freezing column then we put this value this value freezing column otherwise zero so if we extrapolate this formula to the bottom here we have our investment plan inside the timeline now we will extrapolate these formulas to the right Now we can see, for example, um, we can make some um, data setup.
let's make it clean empty um, let's specify some data for example we are going to buy some bricks for construction works bricks uh, we're going to buy um, 15,000 bricks for the price of uh, 1.5 each we are going to um, um, to purchase bricks in February 2022 here we can see our bricks then um, then we will have to um, uh, make some uh, equipment to buy some equipment equipment so this will be um, one item uh, this will cost for example uh, 230 and we are going to buy the equipment on 22 uh, March for example so we can see then for example we are going to start some advertising uh, this will be also one item and the cost will be fifteen thousand dollars this will also be in 22 in March So and now you can specify all these uh, items you can see the totals how much financing how much money you need uh, on the investment stage before you start the revenue before you get the first revenue so here you are specifying what you invest in uh, then you specify uh, how much you invest in quantity and pricing for uh, of, one, of one unit then you specify when you invest specifying month and year and then all this data flies into the uh, timeline giving you um, the totals of uh, of financing needed on the investment stage monthly so these are the monthly so we can for example add some um, uh, engineering engineering for example this will be uh, this will cost for example four hundred thousand twenty two this will also be in February so you can see how totals are changing so you have a very simple instrument that you can use on the investment stage to calculate how much uh, financing you need uh, monthly on what you need uh, these uh, amount of money so you are looking at this number moving here looking at this number what what this number consists of what are the items that you are uh, financing this or that month so this is very simple instrument so maybe this video will be uh, useful for you you may give us a like subscribe share this video with your friends you can also order financial models from scratch for your unique business ideas we can help you with that so see you guys in next videos, thank you and bye.